sweet baby Jesus, you guys can see everything. That's fine. I'll shrink you. Then we'll see what's what. Won't we? Come on, session. Start doing your thing. There we go. Okay. Then we're good now. And that's all that matters. Perfect. Alright, cool. Hello. Hello, and welcome to Brent Plays With Himself, The Walking Dead. I have started this game like three times, and I've never beaten it. I don't know why, I don't understand what my problem is with it, but I'm going to handle it. So, without further ado, because I don't really know what else to talk about before I start playing, other than, hey, how's everyone feeling tonight? Which, how is everyone feeling tonight? I hope you're all feeling well. I hope you all have a drink. Um, the lighting that you see on my face is from my new desk that has an LED strip. So I chose red, and I didn't know it was going to show up this well. But it does, and it works out really well. So cheers to my new desk, and further additions that will help me stream. But also organized, because right now it's so perfectly organized. It's like OCD dream. Mm, it's delightful. But without further ado, we're going to get into it. So I hope you all enjoy this. So apparently I did this. On... What's this one? I'm going to delete it. I have no idea what's going on here. So let's just start a new one, because I have no memory. Because I'm pretty sure that was like two years ago that I had that. Okay. Standard. More help from UI and feedback? Yeah, let's just go standard. Episode 1, A New Day. Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's do that. I'm hoping to play this as... Oh, I am going to be the character. The character is me. I'm going to put myself in his situations. We will see what happens. How's it, how's it going, Blitz Girl? Yep. The Walking Dead. Welcome to AMC's The Walking Dead. <sighs> episode 1, A New Day. I'm hoping to play one episode a night. That should do me. It should give me enough episodes. Unless they're really short, in which case I'll do two. But let's see what happens. I want to get a good night's sleep so I can get up and work out. Work out! Like this guy. Hey, man. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. What didn't I do? <laughs> you know what they say about reckoning. I don't, but I reckon it's a lot like assuming. Yeah, something like that. Mass Effect. You know, I've driven a bunch I'm debating of getting that. This prison. I've beaten them. I was never a big fan. Now I get the oh. I didn't do it. It's the sun. Every time? Every time. Every time? Every time. Yeah, I'm looking around. Now aim at the target in the rearview mirror. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. What? You've got an opinion then? Wouldn't say that. This is some fun dialogue. Until proven guilty. Ooh, where's that guy from? Even considering who they say you killed. You got a weird chin, man. I got a nephew up at UGA. What? You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. I never played the first or third game. You meet your Wait. wife in Athens? You never. You only played the second game. How do you only play the second game? You want to know how trilogy. I see it? No, man, I don't. Yeah, not really. Not really. Too bad, my car. You might Shut have the right to remain silent, but it don't mean I gotta be. 
then you keep talking. Regardless, could be Come. you just married the wrong woman. Fuck you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a heli in my copter. I feel like there's a lot happening. Maybe we should turn around. Yeah? I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He what? wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. Maybe he didn't he was do an it. He older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over, right where you sit. I feel like that's what I. What kind of is that? Like, like a fussy I don't know. I don't think that's how cops work. I don't think you should do that. Stop. That's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. Zap. He stops and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? They caught I, the I am curious now. Stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't Yeah, he him. definitely did it then. He actually believed it himself. It goes That's to fun. People will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit there's a, depressing and a bit more I got hilarious it. There's if I do a, say so. What's out? This other time... Dun dun dun! I think we're good. Hey, there's a person. I bet everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> Splat! I wish it did that. I wish it had like the things where it was like, you're wearing a cool shirt tonight. I am wearing a cool shirt tonight. I wore it this side because that's the mirror. But yeah, I am wearing a cool shirt tonight. <sighs> ah, stretching out. Working out. Fuck. Michael? Hello, officer. You. What is going on? Why the hell did he have his gun out? I don't know. Hey, hey, officer, are you all right? Oh, that's I'm right. still cut back here. I was like, why is it done like that? Maybe it was tossed from the car during the wreck. You're a dummy. All right. Officer. Oh, that doesn't look good. He wasn't ejected from the car. What's the uh, I sure. Is there anything else? Wait, am I still cuffed? Damn it. Oh man. So there's nothing else to look at. Just to be safe. I need to drag myself out that window. Okay, well, I don't need to. I'll try to use the mouse as much, because I know my keyboard clicks. I don't know if you can hear it in my mic, though. I hear... Apparently, like, I'm using this mic now, because uh, Sean told me that, like, I didn't sound that bad through this. So let me know, like, I, if I sound awful, be like, dude, you sound pretty bad. But, oh yeah, I guess I have to move. But I think I feel... I think I sound pretty good. Hopefully. What are the chances that he's dead? Okay. The officer's shotgun is over there. Yes, thank you. Hey. Right. empty. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Okay. What about that? On the ground. 
Dude, just fucking kneel. Like, I've never really... It's not super loud. That's good. I, like... I've never hurt my leg that badly. Officer. But also, like... Get your shit together, man. God damn. God damn. Uh... Officer. God damn. Okay, but... Okay, there. I was like... Officer? Oh. I'm just repeating that now. Hey, grab them keys. Uh, yes? Shit. Get it. He's not gonna bite you. <laughs> <laughs> He's so paranoid already. Really? Officer? You saw that? Ah, oh, Jesus! Holy shit! No, thank you. Got the gun. Get away from me! Oh crap. Don't make me do this. I feel like the aim was off. Ew. First zombie dead. No, oh, keep that. Uh, I guess you don't have any ammo. This kid's all rock and he smells like shit. What the hell is this? Whoa! Shooting. It wasn't. It wasn't me. It wasn't the black guy for once. I say for once. That's super racist. They aren't that. No. I apologize. No. It wasn't me. <clears throat> I already feel bad about saying that. <clears throat> I'm dying because of it. It was. It was. It wasn't me. They're gonna make it look like me. <clears throat> Wish I had that gun. <clears throat> How long have you been dead for? Why do all these people look like they've been dead for, like, ever? Climb that fence. It's a solid fence, man. Guys, there's some noise over there. We gotta go. Follow the noise. Where are we? Is that a tea set? Hello? Anybody? Fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. That's not what you drink it out of? No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. You talk funny. Hello? Anybody <clears throat> up there? Help! Hello? Anybody in there? I thought I saw a little girl in the forest. Are you up there? I'm not one of those things. Keep talking. I guess it's empty. Ah, come on. Real quick to give up on that. Okay, I'm not dealing with that. There's a wagon. Somebody! 
Yell if you can hear me. That. I can't go back out there. I didn't want you to. I just want you to look around more. You make a lot of assumptions here. Whatever your name is. All right. Did I get his name? I don't know what his name is. I'm going to call him... Steven. Yeah. He seems is like a Steven. Is there anybody here? Yeah, you're all alone. Maybe I should just check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. I see. I see. So I'm not smart enough to play this game. I wonder if anybody's home. Nah, we're good. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Hello. Anybody <laughs> home? I need a little help. Hey there. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? In the U.S., that's a valid thing to say. Especially if you're Morgan? No, Morgan is Hello? the African American guy from intruder. Walking Dead and not Fear the Walking Dead. One of them. What's this guy's name? Okay. These people might need more help than I do. Right. Yeah, alright. I think these people are dead. Like, let's have a little bit of respect here. Guy. What's this? Aww. A little unicorn. <gasps> Fruit. It's fake. Damn. What? Why would you have fake? What? Why? Why do you have fake? Why does people? Why do people have fake fruit? Fake fruit is dumb. It's and I, and I like I understand why because people are like. Oh, it's for decoration only. You know what else is for decoration? Real fucking fruit that you put in a bowl and then you eat it. But instead, you wasted money on plastic. Oh, hello. God, that kid lived here. Yes, yeah, obviously the kid. There are three new messages. This whole neighborhood is deserted. What the hell? What in the damn hell? Ugh, cables out. Does it not have rab ears? Richie Rich. I thought that was a frog. I thought that was a frog. It's not. It's a backpack. Fine, I'll check you. Maybe there's something on there. Obviously there's not. Get your shit together, man. Three new messages. Oh, here we Message go. Message one. Left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra. This is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave. Whoa, and music kicked telling up. Us anything oh, about wait. <laughs> please, please, oh. just leave the city oh, and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's nine one one. We love you. We love you. We love you. Okay. Well, Daddy. Huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Ew. You didn't even fill the glass. You just drank whatever was in there. Is that spaghetti? This place has been ransacked. 
Just about anything worthwhile is gone. What's this? A radio? Ahoy, oh, hey. Hello? You need to be quiet. <laughs> okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me. But I'm hiding until my parents come home. Obviously, this is the little girl. I'm gonna clue into this. Don't ask where she is. Oh no, where is she? What's your name? I'm Clementine. Always get a child's this name first. Hi, it builds Clementine. that trust. I'm Lee. Lee, that's his name. Lee. Uh. How old are you? Eight. Ooh. And you're all alone? And yes. you're all alone? I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. It's pretty old. Where are your parents? On the machine. They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? That's a good question. I'm outside in my tree house. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Befriending see? an eight-year-old, because that is what life is. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Give me the hammer! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Give me the hammer! No, he has a concussion. He needs to lay the fuck down. There. Also, he probably has a cracked, like, neck. <laughs> because... Did you kill it? No. I put it to bed. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think so. <laughs> That's the best Sometimes answer. Did you kill it? I don't know. Have you killed one? No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. <laughs> Did you kill it? I don't know. I think that might be a little while. You know? <laughs> I don't oh. know. Look, I don't know what happened. You don't know I'll a lot, Lee. Empty until then. Which is fair. Like, I don't know anything. Either. What should we do now? Um. Let's look we for help before it's dark. Help before it gets dark. Yeah. It's not safe at yeah, night. safety of daylight. Never go out at night. You don't see shit. Let's go. Stay close to me. Stay close to the blood-covered man who's not your father. I like to think that in this, uh, like, there is that level of just, like, gut feeling. Where if you meet someone you just don't trust them, then, like, you just don't trust them, right? Like, it's just that innate sense of trust that you get with people. Because I've met people who are very nice. Like, I've met very nice people. But I do not trust them. And, like, I couldn't tell you why I don't trust them. I just don't. Hey, Seth, there's people. Uh, uh, oh, man. I ain't never getting home to Mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. What? Shut up. Yeah, you know, like, there's just that innate, like, sense of trust that you see with someone where you're just like, I trust you. What's the matter? And sometimes it's bad. Should I like, stay? Your gut knows. 
I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should. There's that innate sense that what you can just like trust or like get along with someone, you know? I think that's a fair thing. Uh, uh. I won't leave you though. Yeah, that was faster Let's than I go thought. Somewhere safe that's close, okay? Yeah, that's, that's a good seems... idea. Yeah, good job, Clem. Good old Clemmy. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! <gasps> Holy shit! I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm not gonna eat you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. I wouldn't be talking. Okay. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta. How do you spell gnarly? I thought it was a K. I'm Sean. I thought it was K. Sean Green. Lee. This is Clementine. Lee. I'm Chet. Shut the fuck up, Chet. You shouldn't be out in the open like this. Sorry, I love you, Chet. You're very good. Okay. And we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. Herschel? I'm not a dad. I'm... Oh, babysitter sounds badass. Her babysitter. I'm her, her babysitter. Out of town. I thought it was a K. I know. G, eh? Let's get Sean going. thinks you're the Stand babysitter now. All right, babysitter. Say things that a babysitter what would say. What do you want to do? Do you want to have Perster for dinner? 5240. The monster's coming. We gotta go. We gotta go. Leave quick. Let's go. What? You're gonna make me do it again. Clementine? Holy shit! Babysitters go. I'd say her parents are you a tip. <laughs> Gnarly with a G. Who knew? Who knew? I'll ask people now, and I'll be like, "Spell gnarly," and they'll be like, "G N," and I'll be like, "Fuck." <laughs> How did you think? K N, and they'll be like, "You're an idiot," and I'll be like, "Yeah." English was my best course. Was it? That truck turned weird. It's a nice blue truck. Always got. Hey Sean, later. I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. What? I'll catch you tomorrow night. <laughs> Who talks it like that? It was nice to meet you both. Mom's gonna be in a snit. What is a snit? Like I know it's probably like a tiff, a worry, but. Thank God you're okay. Who are you? I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you, then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just Oof. you and your daughter, then. Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, I mean, like you hurt your I'm not going to lie. Even as a father, people ask yeah. my daughter, doing so good. do you know this man? Like, right. if I go to a park, Sean, like, if not, like it doesn't happen too often, because I do have, like, the air of, like, a dad. Not right now. Now with the bun and the beard and the glasses i kind of look like the main villain from far cry 5 <laughs> father it's joseph but like i yeah. like when i'm out with my daughter it's i have so like that aura of a father and could divorce. be worse that's what it sounds like seems like things got to um, in the cities what but there's still times where was? it's like people are just like um do you have a kid here and i'm like yeah or it's lee Nice to they meet talk you. to. I'm Herschel Green. They talk to my daughter. Be like, "Are you here with someone?" And that's when I. How'd this happen? I usually go up and I go like, "Sorry, could you not talk to my daughter?" Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed? Before the car accident. Prison. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. 
We hit a guy. I'm not lying. Those things you've been I don't feel like lying in this situation. Who are you with? But yeah, no, I, I still would like go up to people's people and be like, I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another Sorry. Um, in the oh, yeah. So I'll see like a mom or someone being like, because they'll see me show up or like see me talk to her and stuff. And then they'll be like, they'll talk to her. Kind of doing the whole, like, hey, do you know that man kind of a thing? And that's when I go up and I'm like, hey, can you not talk to my daughter, please? And they're like, oh, I was just making sure. I'm like, yeah, I know what you were doing, but also you're a stranger. Like, don't talk to my daughter, please. And that's when they usually like, no, no, I'm sorry. And I'm like, it's fine. Just talk to me if you have questions. Like, I'm the adult. I don't know what you saw. She got a head injury once. She ran into this corner of those, like, cork boards that have, like, the aluminum siding in school, which now I'm old and I'm like, that's not safe. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Like oh, but she ran into it. It was a big here, cut, John. and we yeah, went to the I'm hospital serious. for it. And Please, the nurse she was like, you "How'd you get it?" And I was like, I, "Like I was just casually gonna answer it." And she's like, "I need her to answer it." I saw a cop come back from the dead. And uh, well, you think you should. Like she's like, "Oh, I need your daughter to answer." And I was just like, "What?" And then I realized I was like, "Oh, right, domestic abuse and stuff." And I was like, "Oh, people ruin it for the rest of us." Like, well, I'm all done here. I always compare it to that like clothing that says "Do not iron while wearing," and you're like, "Oh, dummies ruined it for the rest of us." I can't even be a good parent now. Probably just automatically has to be asked if I'm a shitty parent. Which I guess, like, we'll I get why it's good. It you'll be fine. Annoying. Okay. Why can't people just be good? There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow. Which way you think you're headed? Ooh. Um. Drinking, I suppose. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. All right then. Well, Herschel seems nice. I'm sure. In the story of Walking Dead, nothing bad will happen. Sucks that I don't it get to see me. Smells like shit. shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. Shouldn't talk like that. That was a swear. Yeah. I'm gonna swear a lot. I miss my mom and dad. Oh, I bet. Um, how far is Savannah? Pretty far. Okay, good. Uh, I was like, please don't make that a okay. chat thing, because <laughs> I don't know how far. Atlanta is to Savannah. Is making a real place? I'm going to say it is. I love you, baby. <laughs> I always have dreams where people are like, I love you, baby. <laughs> mm. Those are the good sleeps. Hey, get up. Who are you, legend of... Mm -hmm. Legendary man. What an itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy Shit. scared them all away, huh? I'm not I'm, uh, the dad. dad. Name's Lee. I'm, I'm the Kenny. god. Dad, we're gonna know a fence. There's a tractor and everything. Well, ask her. Ask your roommate how far Savannah is. Get going, or we oh, no. The end of it. Yeah, from Savannah. Ask. That's my and then also ask if making's a real place. Call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? Ah, quack. It is. You were on your way to Macon. My well, family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. It's not that cool. I've been on a tractor. I can keep Was an it cool eye the first time I saw a tractor? I don't remember. Do Not a big outdoorsy guy, so... Probably not a fan. Uh, Alright. Well, let's talk to you. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? 
Yeah. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. That's, well, yeah. That's not right. So you My daughter's nine, and, and she's in grade it's almost four. like we didn't see people eating each other for the past So either years. Clementine's been held back three years, or something's weird about U.S. So, uh, school system. What do you do when corpses aren't walking around? <laughs> I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. That doesn't make sense. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. That's what is not it that weird. you do, Lee? That's not right. I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon. UOG. Back to U -O -G. It can't stay. Go Bobcats. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. So how is the city? Getting through the city. Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want to go home to yeah, look good. But even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Eh. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? I was on my way to prison, so... Anybody in their right mind would. Families and barbecues and beers with good friends. All of those things. Yeah, that's those why I listed the things them. we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Okay. Ciao, Bella. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. All right, fine. Do you need any help? What, what do you mean? mean? Well, I mean no. in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I think I've got it handled okay. Long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep Good that point. in mind. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought what? he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon him. You said you thought he was kidnapping him. What was he actually doing? We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Nothing gonna phase me now. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad. Gee, I wonder how that's relatable boat, right yes. now. You've got a, <laughs> I'm a commercial <laughs> fisherman. Catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Sorry, Kacha would be wild about it, but the boat's Don't not catch that bad. dolphin. See you. Don't don't catch dolphin. Oh, this is cool. No chickens. Oh well. Oh well. Uh, yes, I could go check on them. I don't want to do that. Whoa! How am I already back here? Anything? No. Is no one in here? Okay. Can I get inside the house? Maybe have some food? I don't think I've eaten today. I sure would like to. No. Seems like those two are getting along. Where's Herschel? Man. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. No. I can give you sure a don't. critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Oh, shit.
I don't like talking to the kids. Sean's still working on that fence. Yeah, I know. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. What length? <laughs> My dad doesn't know how bad it is. I'm sorry, what are we doing here? That's not how you cut wood. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Damn. Oh shit, damn. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Wasn't that the first episode of Walking Dead? Didn't Rick Grimes shoot the girl in the head? Is that what he's talking about? Huh, maybe. I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Sean Dad just wants that. to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. It's not how you cut wood. That's driving yours? me up the wall. I'm not a, a handyman, but that's not how you cut wood. My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. God damn, that's, that's probably all you need to cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh, I'll go to the barn right now. Wow. That's like the one thing I remember is talking to Herschel. Like I said, I, I played the first bit. I think I beat the first episode. So this is now a replay. Until I get through that. Hello. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I'm not gonna lie to him. I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Nope. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon. Parents are in Macon. My brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now yeah, you've got too. this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Kind of what happened. Hmm. What? Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. Well, at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Go! I'll get my gun! He saved the boy. Hey, you have to. I 
chose the boy. I chose the small child. I chose duck. Hey, buddy. Alright. Let's talk about this. Get the fuck out of here! Okay. Yep. I'm we should sorry. Get... Sorry! Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you... You didn't even try to help. I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now... Please... Let's go. Get out! And never come back! Jesus. I'm sorry. Okay, we really can't stand around because Herschel's told ride us. To make it if you want it. Yeah, obviously I can't stay here. What are we gonna do? Walk? <laughs> My paternal instinct booted it booted up real hard. This is as far as we're going. And it's far enough. Yeah, I mean, we're in the middle of Macon, apparently. I assume this is Macon. Is this not Macon? Yeah, always save the child. It's like in Bioshock when it's like, do you want to harvest the little girl? And I'm like, who would choose to harvest the child? Look! Doc, shut the fuck up. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Dude, it's a zombie. Fuck! Ooh, the guy coming out of the underneath the truck. Run! Glenn? Is that Glenn? Take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. Who are you? I don't know who these people Angry. are. They could be dangerous. I'm a murderer. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I I have to pee. Oh. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. In a minute, Clem. Yeah, sorry. You've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's the leader here. But it looks like she's losing control of her people. If you were in my shoes, you'd be the... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We Jesus, who the, the fuck are you, in. old guy? We all end up bitten. Shut up. We Why are you so aggressive? Smash his head. Why don't we all just fucking so aggressive? What do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, get it. It's a big deal. Let's try to... This was your daughter. 
never would have happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Why are you so aggressive? No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. Yeah. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <laughs> I was like, why won't it go? Man. That was a good use of like visual effects for adrenaline. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. How are That's you? Great, thanks. <laughs> How are you? Uh, guys. Oh, good. I'm glad to remember. Everybody down. Stay quiet. They're gonna get in. Shut. Duck's clean. <gasps> it's okay, it's someone else. I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was uh, uh, Dad! Yeah, have a heart attack. Mm, I'm not motivated to save you. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. <laughs> My pills. Yeah. <laughs> well, pills? bathroom is free now. So how many times do you have to go to the bathroom? Since we got here. Oh, she definitely peed herself. To get in there, behind the counter where the pills are. What? <sighs> There's probably another entrance, maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We Wait. need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll I don't keep think we should be eating deck. nitroglycerin. Isn't that usually what it blows up? Everyone else should get coffee and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here. Out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Deal, man. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the cool. other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? Wait. What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. All right, let's do this. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Mm -hmm. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't oh, tell. Oh, we all flirt. My news editor is hitting about five feet away from me. 
and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. The duck? I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah, she was your asshole. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, oh, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, huh? nothing. Oh. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Does it have batteries? I'm going to go ahead and do my IT. And I'm going to guess no batteries. Have you tried turning it off and on again? There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. I saw one. It was right there. What does these things say? <gasps> Easter egg hunt. The it IT guy. Hey, Doug. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. Yeah. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. uh, not now. Not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. I have no idea why I would ever want to. That seems dumb. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead gods. Oh man, that'd be great if there was. <gasps> Do you like it? Do we not know who that is? What I get? We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Hey, Lee. Really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Ah, oh, you're welcome, guys. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kid. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. I'm a good babysitter. Are you saying, Lee, she spent days surviving on her own? Yeah. That's right. Not just any yeah. little girl can do that. No. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where yes. are they? Should we go looking for them? They, uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah. I don't know why I wouldn't tell the truth. Plus, obviously. Are you guys all right? We're just I don't know that, but considering it wouldn't be an option if there wasn't truth. So. We've all been through a lot. Banana split. Lee, you got a second? Sure. What? What's going on here, Ken? Ken? Is your son dead? Back on Herschel's farm. No. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands. You know. Well, I was going to. It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad you ran away, happened. Kenny. We Kenny, you ran away. You like, think let's... You do when you look back on like, it. don't but take that tone with me, man. Things we... are really out of control. Shut up. <laughs> you don't have any choice. I guess. Console? Try to let it go. <laughs> Would you like this console? It's a PlayStation 2. What'd you guys talk about? Killing that boy back on Herschel's farm? Why? Because we just we're... need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. It's all it now. We'll do our damnedest. Doesn't have to be. Was that battery? And a chocolate bar. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm gonna not talk to you. Is that another battery? Okay. Leg seems better. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. Hello. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before yeah. this all went down. Alright, Clementine. Hey there. Hi. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. You Maybe sure? I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, uh -huh. I think so. As long as the guy... Did a good job. As long as no one with a baseball bat comes so, at him, I think uh, he's gonna be fine. Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm yeah, fine. I'm fine right. I just, uh, I'm good. That's How are, good. How are you? Yeah, I, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Nailing it. <laughs> yep. I'm nailing this conversation. We'll sit tight. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna give you. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Damn straight. Now let's go take care of the other kid. Do, 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 Try do, to get do, some rest, hon. It's not much, but here. For the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's sweet, Lee. But he's a nut allergy, you little shit. Oh, oh. Sorry. This battery should fit the radio. Great. Thanks. Wait, is that the only battery? Here. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Thank you. What's this? Parents? That's suspicious. Well, alive inside. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Is there a sword in it? Make it look I'll be badass. Like you were sure. <laughs> my dad <clears throat> gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Yeah, sure. Here we go. Kids always want to help. I really like... Uh. Okay. Let's How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's no. not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? No. 
Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. Oh. I'm not crazy about it either. All right, a little further. I believe you mean football. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Those are gunshots. Yeah, Why are they gunshots? Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ah, this is a lovely chat. Ow! Are you okay? Shit. I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Well, let's get on that then. There's a band aid in there, I bet. Oh, good. Are you not gonna? Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Yeah, let's do this first thing. A band aid? What's this? My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero. Protector, at least. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, They're track us down. Don't worry. Yeah. yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Ooh. There's a photo over there. Lovely conversation. Am I in the photo? There I am. There's a photo of me. Find anything? Bah. Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. Damn. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention okay. to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. Hey, maybe don't call me a murderer and finish a little girl. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? What's it to you? To me? Whoa. I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy. And the last yeah, thing we need is to like that. Out there. This is good. You've got this little Better girl lighting. Together. Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Beautiful. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Carly. You're the best. Uh, going to... It's in the drawer. Yeah, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna turn into Let's have a look at that finger. Seems like a bad idea. Oh. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Kiss it. Does it hurt when I do this? A little, not too much. You sure? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You've got a nice little cut on the underside here. That's where it hurts the most. We need a bandage for that, I think. Getting an infection might be a big deal now. What do you mean? Just might be tough to get a doctor for a little while. We need to keep you in tip-top shape. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. 
fun. Hmm. It's the remote to my dad's TV. That's what I figured. How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. I would. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. And there was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I, I wouldn't leave it too much. You stopped it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Can you do that more? Well, Aww. I'm not gonna go looking for them. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Mm -hmm. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. Well. Yeah. Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Damn it. Lee? Yeah, what's up? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? No, he wasn't. Oh. Was he bad? He was. Thanks, Ken. Alright. Does anyone... No. Hello. Battery? Yes. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Woot. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? on the talkie or whatever this is Lee what's up hey I'm not her dad so I'm down at that motor in and yeah well uh, I'm stuck stuck yeah I uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group and a bunch of the Roman ones got to jump on me that's dumb I'm hiding over here but they won't leave what's up Glenn's trapped down at the motor in hey Glenn we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you all right <sighs> awesome I'll sit tight till then sounds good I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Okay. I still gotta get these fucking pills. How's your dad doing? Cause how's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds yeah. good. I don't really have anything to say to you, man. Uh, where the fuck is this key? Where's this key? I don't think there's a key, actually. There's no key in here. Okay. <clears throat> Nothing in here. Nothing in here. Here. How we hey. doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yes. Let's have a look around. Okay. You have to. 
No other option. Jesus! Uh, go be sick over there. Eat. As far as I can tell, it's all the care of it. Yeah, but I didn't Whatever see them when I was back there. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. Is that my brother? Oh, shit. What? Do you know that guy? He could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? No. Oh, I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. That's lucky for that. Mm -hmm. The one time. Could be anybody, you know. They start rotting and they'll cheat up and. Shut up, Doug. <laughs> Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. How about that this? guy over there has the keys? How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Think you can do anything with this? Do. What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. You memorized. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? TV! That got a few of them to take notice. Ah. The boob tube doesn't work. Okay. What here? Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Yeah. Okay. Jesus fucking Christ. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doug. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. I can't reach that brick. Get him to reach it. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Right. Let's head back inside. Okay. I don't know how much longer I have in this chapter, but I kind of want to... I need to stop. Hopefully, 
enough that if I want to continue playing this, it's a good episode. So uh, I'm going to stop here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I got to go to bed. I got to read and stuff like that. It's a work day. Um, love this lighting. It's really doing wonders for my skin. Um, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I'm going to keep playing this. I want to beat this game finally because I've heard great things about it. Um, I, like, I, I think this is where I always stop playing it because I just lose interest or something better comes up. But I'm going to keep playing it. So anyway, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, have a good evening. I can't quit the game. Delightful. So let me see what I can do about that. All right. Bye, everybody.